Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedient PC Audio Labs again. Today we're back with our Cubase video tutorials. And on today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to export selected tracks in Cubase. So, um, why do you need to export tracks, number one? Well, let's say that you recorded something in Cubase and you have to share this with, um, let's say, the mix engineer or the mastering engineer. Uh, they might be working in a different DAW. So if that's the case, you might want to just send them the audio files so that they can mix them or master them or edit or whatever it is. Uh, now, if they have Cubase, you might want to just share this, the project if you want to, right? Um, but chances are it's going to be another one. There's so many options in the market. So typically what we do, we export the audio of the tracks and just send it to them. So how do you do it? Well, so Cubase has this option called, um, or this function, it's called export selected tracks. That basically you select the track you want to export. Let's say in this case, the this lead track. So how do we do it? If we click on it, it goes uh, highlighted. So that means that it's selected. You can actually see here in the inspector. So we go file, export, and then the third option says selected tracks. So I'm going to click there and it's going to ask me, okay, export selected tracks. Do you want to copy media files or just reference them? You always want to copy them. You want to copy the media files because that's what you're going to give them. You know, it's the actual audio file. So um, you can check this option for compatibility with, with Cubase, Nuendo 10, and some other like older programs, but typically I don't use that. Uh, but I do want to copy media files. So I'm going to press OK. And it's going to ask me, OK, select new. Where do you want to export these tracks to? Well, in this case, this track, because it's just one that I'm going to be exporting. So I've created a folder here called exported audio where I'm going to drop it. So basically, um, you're telling Cubase, hey, this location, I want you to copy the file associated to this quote unquote lead track and that file, please paste it, the copy of it, paste the copy right here on this folder. So what you would do, you would basically send this folder to whoever is mixing or mastering or editing so they can import that into whatever DAW they use and keep working. So anyways, um, as I said, I have a folder called exported audio. I'm going to go select folder. It does its thing and it's done. Now, if I open my Explorer, right, and I go to my exported audio, you're going to see there is a folder called media. If I double click there, there is my lead uh, audio, quote unquote lead, which is the audio from the lead track. Now, if you right click it, you can see, you know, the properties, it's a WAV file and you can see all the information associated to it. Okay. So now this WAV file, you can share with whoever is requesting it. Now, keep in mind, I did it for one track, but you could, uh, you know, you could select multiple tracks by basically holding uh, you, you can click on the first one and then hold shift and click on the others and you'll be creating, uh, selecting more than one. Um, you don't have to do, you, you don't have to do one by one, but uh, you could do two, three, four, whatever it is at the same time. And they would go once again to that folder that you uh, previously set. So that's it for today. That's how you export selected tracks in Cubase. I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we'll be happy to help you. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well, then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.